Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I will guide you through the process of converting your Wix website to a PDF file in 2023. While Wix doesn't offer a built-in export option for PDF conversion, we'll show you a workaround using screenshots and a third-party tool. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So first, let's start by opening whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser. And of course, in your case, you can use any other browser they could possibly have. Once you open that browser, go to this URL section, simply type wix.com and hit the enter button. So if you have an account, make sure to go log in into it. But if you don't have an account, you can simply go and create your account. Click on get started, register, sign up and follow the prompt and enter your information and credential like email address and etc. So you will create your account. Once you do so, make sure to get into your dashboard and of course, get into your site. And of course, the first step is to prepare your Wix website for conversion. So review each page and make sure it's in the desired states before capturing the screenshot. Remove any necessary elements or temporary contents that you don't want to include in the final PDF. So first, let me just go here and click on edit sign, the site. And of course, uh, as I said before, you make sure to go and prepare your Wix website as you wish. So let's just wait for the page until it loads correctly. And of course, here you can click on preview and see if your Wix website is uh, showing as intended and you will be able to start. So of course, uh, next you will have to go and capture screenshots of each page of your Wix website. You can use the built-in screenshot tools on your computer or browser extension specifically designed for capturing web pages. Ensure that each screenshot captures the entire visible portion of the web page, including the scrolling content. And then, you, once you have captured the screenshots, you will need to combine them into a single PDF file. There are several ways to do so. One of the options is to use a PDF conversion software or online tools that allows you to merge multiple images in a PDF file. And then you will have to go and upload your screenshots in the desired order and follow the instructions to create the PDF. And of course, after re uh, generating the PDF, review each page and to ensure that the screenshots are clear and accurately represents your website's contents if needed. You can use the PDF editing tools to rearrange or crop the screenshots to improve the overall appearance. And once you're satisfied your, your PDF, you'll be able to save it to your desired location on your computer. You can also consider uploading the PDF to a cloud storage as example service or sharing it directly with others by email or file sharing platform. So here's an example. Let me just give you an example. So I'm just going to use the crop option on my PC and you can simply go and get this. Of course, you can scroll down and get another screenshot. Of course, we can remove this the chat later. And okay, let's just go and do a third one as an example. Of course, this is not accurate for me. So for you, make sure to have everything accurate. And here, so of course, here we'll have to go and open a new tab and simply type sejda.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, as you can see, you'll be able to go and use this option uh, free. So as you can see, it's free. Of course, you can even go and log in into your account if you want to use uh, your or this tool uh, on different or on a lot of PCs, for example, and it will keep your files in there. So as an example, we are here, we are just going to click on this merge option and here we'll have to go and upload our files or images. So simply, we can even go and upload them from our PC that we saved. So simply go here to documents and, or maybe I'll find it in screenshots, go to screenshots here. And as you can see, uh, I'll normally find what I want here. So here is it. So click on open. And as you can see, those will be the three. So click on merge PDF files. Here's an example. And here we are. So we'll be able even to edit them if you want to. So it will appear to us as a PDF here. We can even close the gap between them. And as you can see, we'll be able to compress it, edit it, do a lot of stuff. So we'll click on edit as an example. And here we'll be able to edit. So as an example, we will be able to add some text if we want to. 
course you can even do changes by control z if you want as you can see you can add images sign white out uh, annotate uh, so just as an example white out this lit chat from uh, from other pages so as you can see it will be wiped out it's bigger a bit and we can do the same here and of course you can do a lot of other stuff so you can even go add, uh, add annotates shapes and even more as you can see once you're done click on apply changes so it will take some time and as you can see we'll be able to download it right now if you want to we can even go back to edit and once we edit it we'll be able to share it print it merge other uh, things that we want edit it as we said or compress it if the file is too big delete some pages if we don't want to split it crop it and as you can see you'll be able to do a lot of other stuff on this website so here you will be able to edit and sign convert from pdf other split compress security scans so this website so Sijda, will help you a lot during your pdf whatever you want of course once we click on this download as you can see we'll have to go and choose the location so we'll just go and choose the downloads here i'm just going to name it as example test and click on save and it will be saved into my pc as you can see i'll find it right here simply i'll have i can open it up and as you can see i will find the pdf right here and i'll be able to even edit this on my pdf here if i want to but for you of course you can go and edit it online if you don't have any pdf provider and you will normally be good to go of course you can go and screenshot for you all the pages that you have on your wix website not just for me i just showed you before and of course you can even go and change any bugs as you can see i have a bug here you can go and edit it before even you do that you can even do the same for mobile not just the the pc or desktop and you can go and preview for mobile and do the same there and of course let's just go back or back to editor instead of uh, preview mode so as i said here before you can go and edit the bugs that you have as example i have here some bugs so you can go and edit those bugs and then you can go and do your screenshot so make sure to customize everything you want be before you take your screenshots make sure to remove any pop-out messages like this one or things that you don't want to appear on the screenshots make sure to remove them and you will be normally good to go so as an example it seems everything is good here of course you can even go and delete some stuff that's not necessary as an example so you can go and delete those we could be able to delete sections pages or whatever you want of course we can do pages with Control z always you can see the layers from here to delete whatever you want uh, directly and you will normally be good to go so if you watch this video or if you reach this point of this video congratulations you've learned how to convert your wix website to a pdf file in 2023 although wix doesn't provide a direct export option for pdf conversion uh, capturing screenshots and combining them into a pdf is a valuable workaround Remember to prepare your website, capture screenshots of each page and combine them into a PDF using a third party tool as I showed you here which would such that and review the final results. And of course if you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for our channels for more helpful tutorials like this one. So good luck with you converting your Wix website to a PDF and we will see you in the next video.